click start recording and let me read this to you real quick your friend the sasquatch wears pants from steam has joined discord okay apparently i have a friend named the sasquatch wears pants and he just joined discord all right anyways guys we're back with more mass effect just had to take a quick pee break and uh, now we are off to the Hyperion again, where we will talk with Sam in our special alone time chamber, which is over here. See, I know what things are. All right. Oh, that was really awkward. This hadn't loaded in yet. <laughs> Hello, Ryder. Welcome back to Sam Node. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. This is the captain. Stasis revival team should hold and await further instructions. I don't understand the need for secrecy. Your father felt it was for the best. What was he trying to hide? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. And that's me now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. A computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. What do you get out of it? Though I'm artificial in design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. Wow. That's pretty amazing. But beyond what many people will accept, your father knew some would fear it. Yeah, he's got a point. So what does this mean for the two of us? I find myself in an unusual position. Though I had access to your father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. How so? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, <laughs> I didn't know. And dad strikes again. But not without recourse. The further you explore as a Pathfinder, the more blocks will be removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship nice. awaits. New ship Thanks. hype. Okay. So, infiltrators are tech and combat specialists who pro uh, who typically focus on precise hits and avoidance. Sounds like me. I am a sniper, and I am just got a headshot. This profile enhances Ryder's mental and vi uh, visual acuity. <laughs> nice. Allowing him to keep track of his enemies throughout a chaotic battle. Nice. Okay. Weapon accuracy, stability, tech recharge speed, uh, headshot, and weak point bonus. Observe enemies through walls when using a scope. While evading, a brief cloaking device is activated. Nice! So invest in combat tech or biotic skills to unlock more powerful Profiles in a variety of styles. Sweet.
Oh, that's interesting. So this is the everything. So it's a minor buff and everything. This is... Is this combat and biotics? Yeah. Subtle ways allowing him to absorb energy from enemies on impact and shunt that energy into reinforcing his shields. See, that's probably where I want to aim for, but this is a pretty good start. I like this. So you have to have 12 points each. Wow, that's a lot of points to invest right now. Let's get investing. <laughs> so what is energy drain? Restores shields by sapping electromagnetic energy around a target. Causes bonus damage to shields and synthetic enemies and detonates combo primers on all primed enemies. Okay, so this is good if my teammates decide to prime somebody. And I gain health out of it, right? Yeah, restore some shields. Um, overload unleashes an electrostatic discharge upon a target. High damage to shields and synthetic enemies. Very, very interesting. Invasion. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, that's a special... Okay, interesting. I have to find that ability. Infects opponents with an invasive VI, a controlled machine swarm that weakens defenses and spreads itself to nearby enemies. That's pretty sweet. Defensive tech... More damage, tech duration. Okay. Alright, so what if we save that? Then we go up to combat. Grenade, barricade, trip mine, pistols, shotguns, sniper rifles, fitness, or health. That's good to know. What if we get one of these grenades? So it throws a grenade that causes a massive area of damage after a two second fuse. Hold button shortens the grenade's fuse time before throwing. Grenade will explode. Okay, so it's like a standard frag. Pull the pin, count to three throw. Except for it's two seconds, so <laughs> it's a lot less than a five second grenade, I guess. Um, activation requires one power cell, okay. Wait. Oh, so this is a limited supply with thing. Okay. Good to know. Okay. I was like, did they just give you recharging grenades? Because that'd be like Destiny Awesome right there. Is that plus one capacity? Oh, that'd be pretty cool. I kind of want to up sniper rifles. Or no, health. Probably health. Let's do health. What's that, 3% shields next? Okay, that's probably pretty good. Oh, okay. So, 30% consumable effectiveness. Oh, okay. That's all cool stuff. Uh, Korra. So she has four points now. This is something that I do every time I start one of these games. I just give them a little bit extra health just to start. <laughs> um, Nova. Point blank high damage explosion. Sounds legit. 18 points to get to this? Holy crap. That's three of these completed. He has frag grenade. Okay. Havoc strike. Uh, 
Um, charge time 20 seconds. Let's also get that. That way his points go out evenly. Nice. So there's our inventory now. Oh, okay, armor consumables. Okay. Cool, yo. Um, yes, what is next? Journal. Let's go to my ship. Find a way to remove. Okay. And that's the two people on the Nexus. Uh, go to my ship. We'll start there. Hey. Um. Was holding this down doing it now? Okay. Wait, you have to go back? Guess so. That's okay, this gives me time to reply to my girlfriend. Swag. <laughs> I'm sure you guys appreciate that. No, probably not. I think I just activated like six things at once. Whatever. It's all good. It's all good, dude. It's all good. I'm gonna take a sip of water, mute my mic. All right. Is that my guy breathing? All Dang, son. I guess we are running a lot. Wait. Wait, what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. I didn't realize that you had to select which one. Well, frick. Oh, hello there, Cora. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> We used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. you darn right I do everything in style. Frames. They call her the Tempest. Hmm, that's beautiful. All right. Let's go take a closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months <laughs> late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. What's the rush? Just don't want to waste any more time. 
Hold it, hold it. You're not going anywhere. Damn it. I didn't do it. <laughs> wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with the family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. The rigging on her arm got really weird there for a second. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about the it. The lag. Holy crap. It's so loud. All right. Let's go. Come on. Load in screen, please. Please be my friend. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Someday we will load. I hope that's not causing an echo whenever I do that. Everything's state of the art. Labs, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, of course. The best in their field. Ah, glad to see you looking well. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all around wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. She's light, stealthy, and the fastest ship in her class. This mission's gonna be tough. Every plan the initiative made is out the window. Now it's on us to find the way. We all came here ready for a challenge. When you're ready to fly, head over to the bridge. All right. Our pilot should have everything good to go. We gonna do it. I don't think it is creating an echo for you guys. That would be nice. Although I really have to project my voice to get it to go through here. Better head to the bridge when we're ready to go. The meeting room. You can make vid calls from the central table or just get the crew together. Strike we call team this ready the for research deployment. room. You can run research projects and coordinate with the Nexus from here. Some serious care over here. Seems like we're forever racing, but there's always time to check out new toys. Useful ones. Always game for new toys. This makes use of old ones, like anything you grabbed on Habitat 7. Raw minerals, tech, doesn't matter. The research station will strip that stuff down and give you options. Wow. We're on our own, for everybody else. That's what Pathfinder means now. Yeah, well, everybody should be so lucky. This tech is ace. <laughs> if the best we get is what we make, still the best. Check it out. I knew it was going to tell me I could do some research and development. Uh, 
far. Okay, so what is this? This is Milky Way. Julius. Oh baby, a triple. Oh man, this is gonna take a while to get used to. Okay, development. Next, to learn more about the materials required to craft each blueprint. I did not want to click that. Huh. Looks like a rocket launcher almost. Not really a sniper rifle so much. Okay. That's something we'll have to come back for and play with later on. So I have scanned some stuff and found some stuff and done some stuff. Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. You must be Ryder, Gallo Jath. A pleasure to be here, and to meet you, of course. I'll be piloting the Tempest at your word. Quite the ship, but it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios. I guess I'll keep us out of trouble. Plenty of dangers out there, but I'll do my best to avoid them. That's reassuring. Wouldn't want to lose my finest work to that angry cloud. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs out here. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just swipe, touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. Wow. It was optimized <laughs> for a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? I guess we have to be. All right. You darn right we do. Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Ouch, sorry. Uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Helm is green. Gil reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest is yours. Unless you've got something to say for the log. We were all expecting a golden world. Now there's just a long road ahead. But hold on to that dream. It might see us through. Nexus Control, this is the Tempest, Ident 2527, prepping to depart. We departing, baby. Let's go. Swag. Departure vector verified, Tempest. Godspeed, Pathfinder. There's no sound in space. Oh, come on. To Eos, then. What would have been our Habitat 1? Two failed outposts put an end to the idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Callow, take us in. Andromeda Initiative Habitat 1, designated EOS. It was supposed to be an easy first step. Until no one else showed and we got clobbered. Twice. Why has Sam altered frequency detection? What are we hearing, Sam? 
There is a signal pathfinder. I recommend an immediate examination of EOS. So, do we get close to it and then scan it? Is that what happens? I hear that Mass Effect, uh, the main Mass Effect soundtrack in the background there. I love it. A mirror of the signal on Habitat 7. Possible atmospheric manipulation. Is that possible? We'll find out. If it is like Habitat 7, no doubt we'll run into the cat. Oh, okay. Do I not get the sniper rifle? Okay. Gotcha. So it affects my, uh... Have a mod for this? No mods available, nice. So yeah, if I put... Alright, so if I put this on... We, our powers recharge a little bit slower. Let's just try it. Holy, that sound. Ow. Suiting up. <laughs> ready, Freddy. Hope we're all that ready. Callo, all right? Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multi-sensory neural collision. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board, spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. What? I said a lot of people have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Sorry. You okay? I think I'm still messed up by what happened with my dad. There hasn't been much time to process it. No. I mean, I think I'm still feeling it. Like... hearing things, other than Sam. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. We're good. You're good. You're good. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to say that. Beam him down, Scotty. All the memes, I'm sorry. So, so, I'm not really sorry at all. This is my playthrough. Core is hot. Shields holding, adjusting entry. We got this, right? Set us down at this nav point. 